Hello, my name is Kark City 2 and welcome back to our Kark Tech New Horizons Season 2. Uh, last episode we set up part of the Monazite line, it's just ticking away. Obviously, sifting machines probably should just have a, a multi blocks, and I probably will do that at some point. But uh, for now, we're just going to leave these until I get the whole line up, and then we can kind of see what uh we're kind of getting ourselves into how big this thing is going to be and everything so uh, i have added another sifter because that was a slow bit but now i'm pretty sure the mixer is yeah the mixer is a bit slow uh, so this is the bottleneck um, but i am actually going to throw a thing to stop the distillation tank this setup here and uh, i thought about doing the, just leave the hatch there, but have like a um, a wireless to turn off the the things over there. But I figured the easier way would actually just be to move the hatch. So now there is pipes underneath to put that in that tank, and then obviously it gets piped out or uh, gets sent out into there. And now I have a fluid hatch over here. And I'm going to do a fluid detector on this. So if this is full, turn off these things. And I'm pretty sure that will work. I mean, I had a... I had the lever here, so I think this will work. But I don't know. We'll see. Um, I have gone ahead and actually increased this to uh, Ivy. Because this outputs 99,000 or 99 buckets whenever we do that. And the output hatch, the other one wasn't really big enough. And I didn't want to accidentally void stuff every once in a while. So I think what I'll do is just basically, if it's over, it doesn't really matter. I just need it to turn off when I don't want it running. Um, so once it starts filling up, it'll turn off. It doesn't matter if there's, you know, 99,000 or 188,000. It just needs to turn off. So yeah, uh, I need to do this. So enable with redstone, enable with redstone. They shouldn't be getting a redstone right now, so they shouldn't be on. So they are not. So here's a moment of truth. When I do this, are they going to turn on? No, it didn't work. I was really hoping that would work. They might not be getting that signal. Um, trying to think. Wonder if. It, for some reason, it's it's these these regulators just don't want to get the signal without the machine hatches. I think I did that right. Yeah, enable with redstone. Um, what ends if we just do a redstone conduit? That might work, right? Well, this is annoying. Oh. I don't have a electrical wrench because I don't really need it very often, but like at this point would be a good time to have it. All right. Um, oh. Okay, they are actually running right there. Oh, that's right, because it's not... For some reason, I've never really understood why... I think it's one is it one twelve where the conduits start with like the inserts like a red but the extract is like a green. I don't know. But uh I think that is I think that's actually working. Alright, that was I guess that was easier then. If I turn that off, does it turn off? Yeah. Okay, perfect. That uh there we go. That did it. 
I wonder if we actually need the machine controllers there, though. Like, if I just add that directly on that thing, would that... Would that work? I don't want to know. Not that it really matters. You know what? Let's turn that off. Double check. I pull these off. Because these are really easy to actually just put back down. Yeah, I'm stuck. Like, is that going to power that? Also, I wish I could see. Okay, that is powering that. I guess the... I guess the lever just wasn't reaching. Which kind of surprised me. I thought a lever right next to them would have turned that on, but apparently not. I don't know. Let me just double check that it turns off, and then if it does, we're good. Nope. All right, see, this is the issue you're having. <laughs> it just doesn't turn off. Yeah, it's not working. So uh, they're not getting the, the thing. All right, let me do that. Do that. The ratio might be off now, though, because I... Uh, because I was kind of messing in with it. So let me, didn't want to do it that way, let me just remove that and remove the water, and then I think we're gold. So yeah, it does seem like, it does seem like, uh, do it that way. Uh, the other way I was thinking about doing it was possibly wireless and then having the I may actually do that because it would look cleaner I don't know we'll think about it but uh, I was thinking about having the wireless out so um, over there do wireless out to both of these and then have it turn the thing on that way I think that would work if it was directly on the fluid pipe but I don't know all right but there we go. That works for now. Yeah. I could speed it up as well, but uh this isn't actually this isn't the bottleneck. It's uh It may not be the sifters anymore. It's probably the the mixer is probably the bottleneck. Also, um Sorry, I don't remember who mentioned this in the comments. I did see it a couple days ago, but uh, if you shift right click. Oh, wow, look at that. It like shrinks the pipes. I don't know if that's intended, but uh, like it doesn't really do anything. You can't see through it. I mean, you can see through it, but you can't click on it behind it. But uh, yeah, if you shift right click the thing, it turns the the multi-stack so if you have multi-stack input on uh, it can fill up the whole thing otherwise it only does the first one not that it really is super important but that is that's kind of cool to know basically we can store nine stacks in there okay so that is that and moving along here to this one. I think this is where we're at, right? This is where we finished. Neutralized Bonazite Rare Earth Filtrate Dust. <clears throat> Do we need a quest for that? Have I done it? I don't remember where I am. Nope, it's right here. Okay, so we have broken off a couple of the lines. This is the third. third oh, right, I was going to debate what I wanted to do with that. I think we'll just send that into the blast furnaces and we'll just do it that way. But I believe there is, I don't remember. 
come out? Right, it comes out there. Okay, that's what I was thinking. We do need a filter. What is the next part of process? All right, so I need 20 of this. This is the process it's doing. So then what do we do with it? Into another sifter. All right, so there is a whole lot of sifting going on. I don't know... We might be able to condense a couple of the processes down because I feel like the sift's going to go way faster than that, right? I don't know. I'll have to. Yeah, that's 30 seconds. If we have the multi block, I think it'll just. It'll be faster than that. I don't know. I'll have to think about that. But I guess uh, just another. Let's just keep doing the single blocks to get it up and running. I'll throw that in there. All right, so that. Then we get this. I guess that's the next part. Uranium filtrate. Is that? Oh, see, there is the another bit. So there is a whole bunch. This process kind of you branch off the different. Thing. So this part is the uranium. So that's not really part of it. I guess that's what I was trying to say. We get that. And then you can get uranium from this. Which is pretty cool. But we're not going to worry about that right now. So the next part is this. And then blast furnace to that. I mean, that's just super easy. Let's get that, at least the sifter, and then blast furnace up. Okay, and got the blast furnace built up. So basically just sifting there, going in our input bus. You have it turned off. Well, not turned off, but uh, I do have a lot thing on there. Also, I just realized I probably... Oh, I did do safe mode. Cool. Um, probably need this. So let me just pick it up. Go. We'll throw that in there. All right. So there we go. Uh, if this fills up, if this is the bottleneck, it will turn that off. All right. Now this next bit. I don't know if I hit it. I did. Couldn't tell. Uh, we need to create nitrogenated. Is that a word? Nit nitrogenated? I guess. Yeah, I guess that's maybe a word. <laughs> it just sounds kind of funny. I guess oxygenated is a word, but nitrogenated? I don't know. It just sounds kind of funny. Uh, nitric acid. Dried. That. And, uh, going to also do the fluid detectors where did it go ah sometimes my mouse is too sensitive there we go get 10 more of those going i probably have like way more covers than necessary but I like, I like everything, everything kind of be, there's no chance of voiding, I guess. Say. Okay, cool. For a second, I was like, is that not working? Why isn't that going in there? Okay, cool. We got that. So, I guess we'll just continue this line. I was going to go like. Here, but I'm almost thinking I may even set up a whole separate digester for Bass Knight. I think Bass Knight is its own. Doesn't Bass Knight have its own like crazy? Yeah, it has its own line, I think. 
Like that one even goes into an oil cracker. And then it goes into a mixer. So that has its own line. So I'm thinking I may even just do a digester over here for an entirely separate line. I don't know. Long story short, I'm going to continue this down here. Fortunately, the way I have done this is a bit annoying, actually. Let me move this. Yeah, I kind of need to move this, actually. Whoops. Alright, that's actually easy because... The thing's still set. We'll put it back here, I think. The, uh... That's still set. It'd be kind of nice if those kept their panel when you broke them. It doesn't matter. Okay, so that just makes that easier to get to. So we're going to do this into a mixer. Oh. Right, I don't have the Syria mixture dust. I need to do this one, and it's not as good. But I'm not, I don't have any of these ores yet to produce the cerium stuff. I am gonna have to do this way, which actually, now that I'm thinking about it, I should just do a mixer, shouldn't I? That way I wouldn't have to worry about cells. Yeah, that's like a big mixer though for... <laughs> well, I guess I have it all. I mean, I already have it crafted up. And it doesn't matter if we're only doing the one episode. The one episode. The one, uh... The one recipe. Okay, gone ahead and oops, uh, gone ahead and got the next part of it done, which is the mixer. I think it's just going to be easier if we do the multi-block. So, gone ahead and done that. I right, put this away. We just. Yeah, we're good. Uh, I was just counting the amps. I'm like, did I leave enough there? Okay, so we got our nitro something something into the input hatch for that. Got our output hatch here. We got water in the back, and I think that'll... Uh, I mean, it should be okay, right? Uh, this, we're only doing one recipe, so there shouldn't be a clash or anything like that. I just need to throw... ...that on, except that's a bit worrisome. Why doesn't it want to... Right? Water? Right, we do have both. All right, that should be running. Let me. And is that going to be? This going to be like bugged for this? That <laughs> that'll annoy me. Um, what was the? 
Solder, was it soldering iron? Also, is it something totally noticeable that... But I want that. Should. Yeah, it is enabled. Just not recognizing. It's just not recognizing that recipe. Is it looking for this recipe? Is that what it's doing? Okay. So, uh, no matter what I did, I could not get it to recognize either of those recipes. Uh, I tried that one and I also just tested this one to see if that was the issue was it clashing nope it, it just does not recognize it um but I know it's kind of bugged right now um at least on the official version of the pack all right so there is that at least let's do that I think that was yep there is that and then this goes in here. Yeah. And we get nitric, monazite, leach, concentrate, and the cerium dioxide. So the cerium dioxide needs to go in the A system. Don't know if that is. Yep, there is cerium. There's the cerium line. So there's a whole bunch of different lines that branch off. It's pretty cool. But we're just kind of focusing on the main one for now. What is the. Oh, it's only 11%. Alright, well, we'll get it eventually. Let me just attach this. I have the... yeah, I do have a thing in there. Okay, cool. So that is that. At least the... this part of it is 100%. Okay, so... next part. Vacuum freezer? Really? <laughs> Alright. Vacuum freezer gets us this. Electric magnetic separator. Gets us our europium, but it's only a 5% chance. So it's not like we're getting like massive amounts of this, but hopefully just after it uh, is running for a long time, it'll build up. And then another blast furnace with fluorine. Gets us this. All right, let me do the next parts. Do I want to just keep going that way? <laughs> I think so. Because this might be like a whole other line of machines. It does just look really cool when you have them like all in a row and they're all just kind of working too. And I think that's... I think that's it. I haven't really been counting amps. I've just been putting the, the largest cable. Hopefully this is good. All right, so I think this is just that to that. That's all we need. I just realized that is probably not going to be fast enough. 30 seconds, absolutely not going to be fast enough. So we're going to move that to there, and then I'll just throw a thing on it. Um, I do believe there are multi-blocks for pretty much all these now. Okay, that's been on there forever, actually. So that's nothing <laughs> new. But I did notice there is a couple other multi-blocks. Um, like the Rock Crusher and stuff. So hopefully... I feel like by the end of the pack... Or not the end of the pack, but... Uh, we're eventually... We're not going to have any single block machines... At least in the main, well, in all our processing will be do, done in multi-blocks. Like, this is a little bit different, because this is 
just meant for one item. Okay, I am talking away here and I'm not doing what I need to be doing. <laughs> All right, we'll just do that. That to there. And machine cooler. Eventually, this is all gonna, this is gonna eventually go through all the monazite, and it'll shut. All this will shut down. It's gone through about four thousand, but I mean, we will probably have more in the uh, the future. But once it goes through that, I think we probably won't be having much. Oh, actually, I need to get this for the quest. No, I need to get Sirium. That is going directly in a system. All right, and it's quite slow, to be honest. The... We don't get much of it from this process. I just have a conveyor just pulling it out into the... A system. All right, we'll turn that off. Did I get? Yeah. So that goes in there. That goes in there. And that goes in there. Okay, cool. And these are percent chances as well. Did I really not get anything? Did I really not get any Bonazite from that? 90% chance. Alright, so let's continue with the... Oh. Nope. There we go. Maintenance. I need to... Uh, I need to do a recipe for like a whole last furnace because I am starting to craft up a lot of them now like coils and everything like I do for chemical reactors all right so there is that we'll need input bus input hatch Input bus. So how do I want to do this? I may need to change plan. Do a interface conduit and a filter. Yep. So conduit. Or interface will go here. We have, yeah, this surprisingly does not have many. This really doesn't have many channels. This, this, um, this processing line actually we will put. Yeah, we'll put this input hatch here because I have a. I'm gonna have an interface right there. I might as well have that. Have it right next to it, and then that is something. I don't remember what that is. Also, I gotta be careful with my jetpack so I don't. I'm hanging out over the void. Okay, so we got the cooled. We're doing this one now. Chlorine, that's right. So chlorine. This stuff. Oh man, it really wants us to do the europium, that 5% chance. That's going to be a while. Uh, interface. We'll go there. 
and then conduit and filter. So that is the next bit. And then that gets us this, which goes in a multi-block mixer, which I, um, oh, that's the part where we would put the samarium into this. Interesting. I didn't, this is that part. So that actually... Man, that is annoying this multi-block mixer doesn't work. I know I can manually upgrade the pack, but uh, every time I do that, I end up, like, breaking my world. So I always wait for official versions to be uploaded to the launchers. So I guess I will do... All right, let me finish. let me finish getting this up. I do need to build this out a bit more, too. That'll get us that. Then I will connect to this. And maybe do... I don't know, I'll have to think about that one. Is that the line? Oh, that's the line we're actually going for. Yeah, alright, so that's the same. There's the cerium, there's the europium, and then there is the samarium. That's the way we are going. And there is the blast furnace running. Crafting up this hero, Venus, halogenic, monazite, rare earth, mixture dust. What a name. And we'll just put that there. And we're good. Um, I do need to fix this now. I probably will pipe in both. Yeah, I think I'll pipe in both. Or should I have a separate? No. I don't know. I'll have to figure out how I want to do this. I was just thinking, I'm like, should we pipe in both? The Samarium, like, but I would want it to... I wouldn't want it to do all this recipe. I would want it to do, like, this recipe first. I don't know. I'll have to think about that one. Also, I seem to... Having a weird... Kind of issue over here with... Power. And I don't know why but this should be outputting 16 amps or at least 12 amps maybe that's what it was maybe this is pulling the one amp of iv and it could only output three and maybe we pulled more than 12 i don't know i'll have to look into that because it appeared we were i mean some power issues and it would kind of surprise me for some reason there's something like it's not getting enough power at that it was working fine before but now it's not working i don't know that is strange it's just this machine do i need to break it and replace it or something that just seems very weird i don't remember ever seeing a error like that Yeah, all right, that that was weird. Something happened there. For sure, I mean, I didn't change it. You saw I didn't change anything. I just broke and replaced it. So, all right, well, that's something to... Maybe it wasn't a power issue. Maybe it was just like a bug. Okay, so we have pretty much everything. I got to figure this out, but we are out of time. We will continue the thing. We'll get our Samarium, and then... Uh... I don't think we'll do any more of the other lines just for now, just because this is a very long one, so we'll probably take a break from that. But, uh, yeah, it's coming along.
What a cool line. Look at that line. That's cool. Anyway, that's going to be it for today. So thanks for watching and have a good one.